from this week's Racks and Tracks. This week we're heading up to Saskatchewan, Canada. We're hunting with Chris Cook and we're going to go bear hunting. Uh, this is Denise's second bear hunt she's ever been on. Uh, what are you thinking, Ben? Well, I think I'm ready. I've been practicing a lot with my new Synergy bow and it shoots really nice and I'm ready to put a big bear on the ground. All right. Mm -hmm. Well, let's see what happens. Okay, I failed to mention that Denise is going to take her brand new Synergy. Synergy bow, brand new with a brand new rest. What kind of rest you got there, lady? Hand skia. Huh? Hand skia. Yes, you do. Take a look at that rest. Look at that rest. That's one of the best rests you can buy on the market today. They are well built, I'll tell you what, man. That's what she's going to take her big bear with this year, so let's do it. Nice. Good shooting, dude. Right, yes, that's, going too forward. No, that's perfect. What's up there, Chris, man? Not much. How you doing? So far, so good. Yeah. We'll be doing better as soon as uh, Denise gets a bear. <laughs> Denise is going to kill herself a bear. Sure How are they looking, man? So far, so good. All right, man. Well, let's get out of the cold and let's get uh, whatever we need to do. Uh, carry your luggage in. All right. Let's do it. <laughs> Woo -hoo. A little bit of snow up here yet. Uh oh, <laughs> still stuck. There we go. Well, here we are. We're in northern Saskatchewan. We're hunting with Chris Cook, Cook Outfitters. <clears throat> We're bear hunting. Uh, Denise is up to bat. This is our first sit of the trip so far. We baited some baits today. Um, <clears throat> most of the baits were hit. This bait here has quite a few different bears coming on it. Uh, smaller bears, one brown bear. We mainly are sitting here tonight. We're going to try to film this brown bear that's coming in here. It's a pretty bear. Uh, we're not planning on shooting anything unless it's big. So we're, we're here early. It's uh, 3 o'clock in the afternoon. <clears throat> we're going to sit here nice and tight and see what happens. You excited? Mm -hmm. Yeah, this is going to be Denise's first bear. I hope we kill one. She's been on bear hunts before, but she never had an opportunity. So hopefully on this trip that she gets a good opportunity to shoot a nice bear. So there's a big bears up here. We've got some nice bears on camera. So now we just got to sit back and uh, the bait's about 20 yards away from us. I'll show you the bait here. There's the bait, about 20 yards. Right there with the barrel, and we are we are set to rock and roll, man. Good luck, there, lady. Thank you. Shoot straight. And let's get a big one. So much for my GoPro. Well, here we are. We're up in Saskatchewan and we're up here hunting with Chris Cook, Cook's Outfitting. Anyhow, we're going to move to a different bait tonight. Uh, Chris has another big bait set up. He's got a nice, nice bait. He's got some yep. big bears coming in. Uh, we, got a, we got a little bit of luck on our side. Right here she is. <laughs> 
Plus, we went out this morning, we got a few beavers, and we hooked some beavers up on the baits today. Uh, we did a little popcorn popping, uh, put some little sweets in there. Uh, we're going to juice the baits up a little bit, and let's see if we get these beers coming in. So Denise and I are getting out there right now. It's about 4 o'clock in the afternoon, and we're going to hunt till dark. So let's see what happens. Let's do it. Should be a good night. Miller Welding Supply and Miller Industrial Gases is your complete welding and automation source. And after 65 years, everything has changed except our service. At Miller Welding Supply and Miller Industrial Glasses, we pride ourselves on being the leaders in service and satisfaction, while keeping our customers on the leading edge of technology with five great locations throughout Michigan. You can count on us to exceed your expectations. Stop by Bunker Hill Chill and Grill in Burnham's, Michigan. They have great food, plenty of big screens to watch all your favorite sports, and an outside patio that seats over 80 people for all your entertainment needs. Whether it's work, play, or hunting, we trust our trucks to take us anywhere we need to go because they get serviced at Denoyer Chevrolet. Bring your truck in this fall and get it serviced at Denoyer. Nelson Steel Products, located in Holland, Michigan, has been a leader in the steel fabrication industry since 1945. Specializing in steel fabrication, robotic welding, and laser cutting, Nelson Steel Products brings years of experience to their clients. With strong client relations, innovative technology, and a reputation for quality, Nelson Steel has continued to grow in the industry and in your community. When it comes to finding the right partner, it stops at Nelson Steel Products. Visit NelsonSteelProducts.com to learn more. If it's made of steel, we'll make it. You get a chance, you need to check out ASCO's website. Get their product, use their sport wash, wash your clothes, spray it in this UV, you will be amazed. It makes you invisible. Here's old Chris's fancy bridge he built. <laughs> Hang on here, guys. <laughs> Chris wasn't gone five minutes. Here comes our first bear. We named this bear Mask, and you can see why by looking at his face. This was a beautiful sow. We knew we were not going to shoot her, so it gave us an opportunity just to watch her and her coat. We could sit and watch these little guys all day. What a great way to pass time.
determined to get that beaver, and his mom was not going to help him. He finally convinced his sister to give him a hand. That's pretty amazing. He knew if he could break that rope, he could probably get that beaver down. We knew there was something else in the area the way these bears took off. We here at Racks and Tracks take our scent control very seriously. That's why we wear Scent Lock. They are the leading innovators of scent control. Hey, T-Bone here. Let's talk about expandable broadheads. Two inch two blade expandables only have a two and a half inch cutting surface and are actually more like a sliver. G5's T3 all steel big cut expandable has a whopping three inches of cutting surface. Three blades produce three independent flaps, creating a big old chunk. So, do you want a sliver or a T3 chunk? Luminox are brighter, more durable, and with replaceable batteries, the longest lasting compound and crossbow lighted knocks on the market, period. your moment of truth comes, rely on the only lighted knock trusted by the best. Luminock. Light them up at Luminock.com. Sure enough, five minutes later, here comes Mr. Big. At this moment, Denise was trying to get her bowl pulled back. I think it was nerves. When he got up and walked away, I thought for sure he was walking out of our lives forever. I could not believe my eyes when he stopped and turned around and came back.
Get him good. What was that in back? What was that? something I heard something yeah. too and then you looked over there I see you looking at the little nothing there yeah. then all of a sudden you look over here I kept looking back there you see me looking back there all the time oh, that's, a, that's that stud with a, with a crease on his oh head. is it oh yeah I couldn't <laughs> I couldn't get my freaking pull back I was shaking so bad I couldn't get my pull back <laughs> god I'm so proud of you baby oh, oh, god did you hear my arrow hit that? Oh yeah, you thing? punched right through the barrel. Yeah. <clears throat> so I said you punched right through them. I mean, like nothing, just like butter. It would have went straight through if it didn't hit the barrel. Yeah. We got that on backpack. There's your arrow, babe. What kind of broadhead is that, honey? I don't know, Montec. <laughs> it's a Montec, honey. <laughs> That's a Montec G5. All I know is my husband puts it on my bow and I shoot it. Yes, I do. Man, God, was that fun. Yeah, I'm tracking it right here. I got it. A bug right here. Right here. I don't know if you can see butter or not. Can you see it? I can see it on that log. Oh, yeah, yeah something reflected back here. What? Yeah, see it there? Yeah. See the blood? I'm on a trail. There's blood. blood. See the blood? The log, I can see. see it all blood? I'm on it, man. Blood. Blood. Right here is blood. Where is he? Where is he? Huh? You see a bear? <laughs> see a bear anywhere? <laughs> what do you think of that stud? Huh? He's all of 130 pounds. That's what I, that's what I was thinking. Son of a... You're recording, are you? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I am, buddy. <laughs> what do you think of that guy? Else, but you, you, oh, uh, <laughs> you did good. Look at the melon on that Is thing. Is that a stud there? Look at the shot on that thing she made. Perfect. Absolutely perfect. Shot. Oh my. Honey, I am so proud of you. Thank you. <laughs> mm, I am. Get down there. Get down there by your bear. Wow. Get down Look there by your bear. Hog. Look at the size of that bear. Wow. That is, that, oh. You, you know, made, I don't dare touch him. You made that, my day. <laughs> is that a stud, buddy, or what? That is huge. Guess where he came out of? Where? Down near trail. He yep. walked right down walked the trail. Right down the trail. I heard something. I looked back, and I'm like, bear. I'm like, and then I'm like, do I shoot it? He's like, I, 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 I shoot it. And then, so I get my bow up. I get my. I finally get a stand up because I kept looking. And then I stood up, and I couldn't get my bow back. And then my, my heart was going boom, 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 boom. And he's breathing hard again. You were breathing hard was again. Was I? Yeah. I wonder why. And you weren't talking to I me either. I knew how big this bear was, honey. You weren't talking to me either. I'm I like, wasn't going to say nothing now. to you. Shoot it now. Wow. You're like, no, no, yes, no. So then I finally got my bow back. <laughs> I tried to help her pull her bow back. You feel me pulling your arm? Yeah, the first time. <laughs> <laughs> my arm back. I'm like, honey, the bear walked away. I'm like, oh no, it's gonna leave. I was gonna turn and come back. I'm like, oh come on, please get that bow pulled back. She tried drawing it. I reach over there. I'm like, camera like this. And I'm like, <laughs> pull it on her arm. <laughs> right down, Wendy. Walked know. right yeah. down. Yeah. Right straight down. Yeah. Because if you came down yeah. that trail, yeah. I would thought it yeah. was. You say that sound like must have been working pretty awesome. You got a nice spot here, Chris. I tell you what, man. You got some nice bears. Now this, this is what you come to Canada for. That's this, exactly. This is a stud. 
My first bear ever. That, that ever, 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 ever. Tell me there's a woman in a trophy hunter. <laughs> uh -huh. You have no place to go from here. But no, that's exactly huge you just bear. think, this bear right here would be another 100 pounds, another 100 pounds this fall. Yep. On top of what he is right now. Yeah, I'm anxious to put this thing on a scale. I'm going to guess this bear at real close to 400 pounds. You think so? Yeah. Yep. Close to 400. There goes the big bear right there, boys. Nice bear. Good job, baby. Thank you, hon. Oh. Tell you what, these things are great, man, for dragging out white-tailed deer, dragging out bears. You stick these things around your wrist, and they really grip, man. These things grip nice. Uh, we got ourselves a 400-pound bear right here. We're going to unload. Uh, these things work great. Ready? Normally you would never be able to do that holding on to the side of that paw right there. And they come right off, put them right in your backpack. These things are slick. We have to get you a pair of these. We just got some. You just got a pair. <laughs> <laughs>